Okay, I thought I'd show you my little setup I got here. Had to come up the garage and get out of the wind. That southeast wind blowing today is unrelentless. So, um, one of the problems I've always had is plant seed is how to hold the package of seed, hold the seed, and then I always drop it through a piece of PVC pipe to put it where it belongs. And it's just a lot of hassle trying to keep track of all these things. So. I had the idea yesterday, I was out working and I didn't have a pocket t-shirt on, so I went downstairs, I don't know if you can see it there or not, but that is my nail pouch, and that works pretty good. So I went inside and got a, um, well it's just a little butter dish is all it is, what is it, a uh, 15 ounce butter dish, Let's see if I can switch hands here real quick, and then um, I just set that right down in there. Put my seed in there and then it's big enough and get my hand down there and get the seed out of there and it works very well i like it so i got a place to keep my tools on my side and everything so i might just have to become my new gardening pouch there i just it just attaches to my belt there yeah my belly's too big you're never going to see that yeah exactly so anyway so that's kind of what my setup is and i'm going to sit down here and rest my back for a minute we'll see it may 25th i got the second row in this morning Stopped at Baumgars and uh, got a couple more seed packs here. Uh, so this is a green bean called Tender Green Improved. It's a bush bean, so I it's in the second row there, going from south to north. So basically, what I do is um, I just run the tiller down the road that I'm getting ready to plant. I just go real real shallow because what happens is you get all the footprints in there, it packs it down, and it makes it tough to get a row started. So I just Set the tiller kind of shallow, run it down there real quick, and I have a nice easy planting. So I wanted to show you these seeds. I'm not real pleased with this brand of seed here. They're uh, they're kind of black and speckled with black and brown brown speckled bean. They're they're not real consistent, but we'll see how they perform. You know, when you're buying seeds in the morning, you're trying to plant them, you, you get what you can find. So, all right. So, on to the third row. All right, so second row is uh, green beans. See ya. Row three is uh, what they call a dwarf gray sugar pea. And uh, the package says that it's a snow pea. And they're in row number three there. Uh, I don't know if it's coming out on the video there or not, but that's where they are. Got a full row of sugar peas. These are a little harder to plant. The seeds are round and small. They're a little harder to handle with big hands. Um, you see them there. They're not real big, just kind of tiny. So I ended up with quite a few places there that had two seeds in there or whatever, and I dropped a couple here and there, but... Uh, I still have plenty left, so one one package did a 72-foot row easily. It says 140 grams. I guess I'll have to figure out how many pounds that is. I don't know right off the top of my head. So, All right, row three.